Hi, this is Brian Schiff with Functionally Fit. Today's exercise is going to show you how to use a mini band resistance tool to improve hip strength and stability. A lot of times your athletes and clients are going to struggle when they're on one leg, they're going to struggle to control frontal plane collapse or internal rotation of femur. So this is a little grid exercise I'll use with our clientele to improve hip strength and really improve their single leg control. So you'll see that I've got this green mini band around my ankles. I usually start our athletes there and uh, it's about a medium level resistance. And the directions I'll cue them to do, we're gonna show you three. I'll uh, we'll kind of first have them bend that stance leg, get an athletic position, kind of activate their core, and then we'll have them reach, touch, and come back. And so that's the medial direction. And we'll go a little posterior medial reach, light touch, back, and then extension, touch, and come back. So we'll run through those again here, Diagonal and straight back. Okay, the whole time they're really focusing on controlling rotation. We don't want rotation in that front leg, so the band's going to pull them into rotation. You've got to activate the glutes and all the rotators on this side to control that motion. So it's a great way to do it. If they can't do it in a grid fashion, like I demonstrated, you know, a lot of times we'll just regress and we'll do one isolated movement at a time so they can mass perform and function that way. So again, a mini band, great way to do it. If you want to make it a little bit easier, we can slide the band up and we can do it here where the resistance is less for them as well. So I think you'll find great exercise to strengthen the hips and improve proximal stability.